How's it going, everybody? This is Golden Walt, and welcome back for some more Star Fox Adventures. In the last part, we got back here to Thorntail Hollow and reunited Tricky with his mom. Uh, first thing I want to say is uh, I apologize if you hear, like, wind in the background. I have no air conditioning where I am, and there's a fan blowing on me. Yeah. And uh, if you remember, his mom was really sick, and we need to go find white grub tubs. And, uh, well, I really hate that this doesn't stay up there. Cause I just like to blast these little these guys out of the sky because they're so freaking annoying. Like that. Shut up, Tricky. Um. Yeah, this is actually where we gotta go. Believe it or not. You gotta tell Tricky to find a secret. As uh, if you can, if you remember, he can dig through holes. This is actually where you gotta go. You may have not thought that this was that big a deal, but uh, actually is. Okay, Tricky. You stay here. I'll go search down there. But I need to help my mom! And you will be by staying out there. Okay, Fox, but hurry up! My mom looked real bad! Alright, now, uh... It is a dream come true. Tricky will not be coming with us. Uh, before you go down here, I would, uh... Advise that you first watch out, because that is a mushroom that will hurt you. And, uh, make sure you stock up on... Bomb spores, because you'll be needing them. Um... Uh, I don't know why I had to do that. Um, if you look at this, this is a rocket boost pad. Use the staff upgrade in your inventory. Hmm, we don't have that staff upgrade yet. But yeah, we're already getting our second staff upgrade. Oh god, what what is going on, camera? Okay. What's getting me killed here? Um, this is a semi-dungeon, I guess it would be called. I don't know why I just did that. Watch out for those things. Those things are going to pop out at you. It's It's really not cool. If you notice, the staff is glowing. And, uh, there's a bomb spore seed there. You're gonna be, uh, the good thing about this is that you will be finding lots of bomb spores throughout this, uh, small dungeon thing. But, uh, yeah, you need to blast that open. And that's gonna give us another access to another well. And here we are in one second. I will be right back. Alright, I apologize for that. Somebody's outside vacuuming, and I was like, what is that? But anyway, we are here in another well, and if you notice, this is a water well. So, uh, it's different than the last one we've been to, and as I said before, the water well gives us a new staff upgrade. So let's jump across here, fall in the water, of course, and get our upgrade. This is the staff rocket boost. Yeah, those pad, that pad that we saw earlier, now we can use it, and we can fly upwards. Uh, you can set this to Y if you want. I personally just like to leave the uh, fire blaster at Y, uh, because I like to have a ranged attack easily accessible. I don't know. That's just me, though. Alright, sorry, I was just checking my timer there for a minute. I was like, what the heck is it doing? But it's right. Now if you notice, right here, we've got a switch, but it's gonna be one of those switch duh, one of those switches that uh we can't quite hit right now, and you see that that we have a staff rocket boost, and if you saw up there, got some fuel barrels, so let's test out the booster. Put it in there, nah, put the staff in the switch thing, and then you gotta hold down A and you will fly upward. I was gonna say put it put it in there, yeah, just stick stick the staff right in the hole. Not what I wanted to say at all. Uh, you can get more bomb spores if you want by shooting this. Um, you can only carry seven, so I mean, it only helps so much. And yeah, they're gonna get stuck to the walls in this place, which gets so freaking annoying. Don't ask me why, I have no idea. Um, now if you remember, we did pass that other staff rocket boost thingy back here in this first room. So, naturally, what we're going to do is uh, use it over here to get up on the upper ledge in the other room. Those things are freaking weird. Don't think there's... no. There's spazzing out there, mushroom. Um... Oh yeah, okay, I was like, what What do we do now? Yeah, I remember what we do. Being dumb, there's a giant bomb spore thing right there. All you gotta do is plant a bomb spore in the middle of it. As weird as this logic might be. You're going to shoot the bomb spore from up there, and 
and it's going to cause a block to fall. How perfect. Perfect size to cover up that thing. Uh, I don't think there's the... God dang it, I don't think there's any type of bonus thing around here besides this. That'd be cool if I would stop getting hurt, hurt by those stupid... Those things. Those things are getting annoying. I don't think there's anything over here, but I will check because I have to. What the... Alright, that's getting old. My cork bo I have a cork board, like, behind my desk. That thing falls off the wall all the time. It's so annoying. Just letting you know now. I don't know if you heard that, but if you did, 10 points to freaking Gryffindor. Okay, now that we have pushed that block, you saw that the door opened. Where's the... Did I go the wrong way? Here's the entrance. No, it's not. Wrong way. <laughs> Yeah, I'm supposed to be showing you how to play this game. Way to reset my camera. Now, um, this area here is where you would normally uh, need to go backwards. Because uh, if you remember, we bought the Firefly Lantern in the last episode. Uh, that is what we need to continue here. This guy is basically going to like... Yeah. That reminds me so much of Conker's Bad Fur Day kind of dialogue there for some reason. Uh, yeah, more bomb spores. <laughs> That's what you get. Um, no, but, uh, where this is basically the area we can slide down, uh, to get white grub tubs. Now, don't be fooled, the first one is right here. Easily missed. People can go searching on forever trying to find that last white grub tub. There are six in here. So yeah, you need to collect six of these and feed them to the Queen Earthwalker. There are six in here, but there are five that you find throughout here, and people often go freaking out, looking around. The first one is right there. Don't miss it. Don't remember what I was originally talking about. Oh yeah, the Firefly Lantern. Basically, you see how dark some of these areas are? And you see these guys right here? These are fireflies. What the heck? And we can collect them. It says here, this is a firefly. It will be stored in your lantern. Let one out when you need to see the dark. God, these things are dive bombing me. Uh, one. Okay, that one's being kind of annoying. God. Yeah, alright. Now, we have some fireflies. You can go over here. These are, you see a white grub tub up there. You do need all six of them, though. And don't worry about finding extras or anything. There are no bonus white grub tubs. There are exactly six in here. Why do I not remember those guys being there? Anyway, we got two. That was getting annoying. Uh, okay. I think we can drop down this way. You can see it's pretty dang dark in here. We got another white grub tub, grub tub over here. Now, um... In cases like this is when you can use the Firefly Lantern. Where is it? There it is. And it lights us up, lights the way up for us. If I remember, there is a bomb spore thing? Maybe it's in another dark room. I think it is. There are a uh, handful of really dark rooms throughout here. And, uh, I mean, it's not too difficult to get lost in this area, but, I mean, it's, it's very possible. Here's one of the dark rooms that we need. I believe this is the bomb spore place. Yes, it is. You're going to need to uh, plant a bomb spore here and blow it up. This is why you... I mean, I don't think you need to have all the bomb spores, all bomb spores, but it, it's definitely helpful. And I just seriously blew myself up. Got a white grub tub hiding over there. Uh, what do we have? How many of those do we got? We got four. Nice. Uh, I am tired of these mushrooms. They are freaking annoying. Uh, I think that's all we can really do in here. Where's my lantern? Because I would love to be able to see. That's our cheat token we got to, we've yet to take back. Now, uh... I think those are the white grub tubs of the dark areas. I don't think there's any more... Uh, you can get some more bomb spores. Yeah, you can see number five and s numbers five and six up there. Now let's see if I still remember how to do this. Man, I'm tired for some reason today. 
There must be a bomb. I think there is a bomb spore some or something down there. Yeah, I mean, there's got to be something, because, uh... Yeah, I'm dumb. I are totally dumb. I'm not even using that meme. <laughs> there's definitely a bomb spore thing right there, and I just flew right... flew? I just walked right by it. So that's gonna knock that down now. We need to leave and come all the way back around. In order to get up there. <sighs> Again, I do apologize if the commentary is weird and everything. I, uh, I am pretty tired for some reason today. Now, you, as you can see, that fell down. And, uh, yeah. For some reason, I just want to, like, sleep for, like, an eternity. No, not like that, but I mean, like, I'm so freaking tired for some reason. I don't know why, because I'm... I get more... I got more sleep than I did on, like, high school. You are such a jerk. And that gives us the, a little ding noise saying we've won. I don't know if there's a way... I think there is if you shoot this bomb spore. But I don't really need any more bomb spore things. What I need is some health. If you heard that little ring thing, that means we do have all six of the uh, white grub tubs. So uh, now we got to climb this ladder really slowly and get out of here. And this is pretty pathetic. I've uh, lost two-thirds of my life pretty much from uh, getting hit by stupid mushrooms. Never have I been more excited to see a box with a uh, puck puck egg or whatever. Uh, da, da, da. So that is all for this small mini dungeon thing here. You need to get out, go find Tricky. It's, hasn't it been great, everyone, having a break from Tricky? Because we all love him so much. Just kidding. You jerk. God. I hate that there's a mushroom. It's going to get me again. I know it is. Oh, I guess not. I hate, seriously hate that there's a mushroom right there. Climb, 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 climb the ladder so slowly. All right, and we're just gonna crawl out and reunite with everyone's favorite Prince Tricky, wherever he may be. There he is. Music still isn't. We're going to your mom. I got your freaking white grub tub. So stop freaking out. Yeah, music is still not too uh, cheerful here, as you can see. The Stupid Sharp Claw. Sharp Claw here, still. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. That's the uh, backwards one. The backwards combo, if you hit down on the control stick, it does that. Let's try that again. That was pretty sweet. You, you pretty much just got kicked the whole time. But whatever. Now to return to the Queen Earthwalker. Oh, right. You need to actually give it to her. <laughs> she can't even talk. Thank you, Fox. Thank you for saving my son and for saving me. Okay, okay, enough of the thanks. No, I need some help from you. Can you just tell me what's going on? This is all the work of General Scales. He is the ruler of the Sharp Claw tribe. A nasty bunch of pirates who have always wanted to rule Dinosaur Planet. We have always been able to stop his attacks. But this time he somehow becomes stronger and defeated our army at the Krizoa Palace. Right, a bad guy. But how did the planet get in such a mess? Within the Krizoa Palace, he broke the seals of the Force Point Temples. I'm listening. This planet is rich with a magical force, a force so strong that it is continually pushing our world apart. To stop this, four spellstones were placed inside the Force Point temples. Okay, that's a bit weird, but I understand. With the seals broken, Scales entered the temples and removed the spellstones. With nothing to hold back the magic force, the planet was torn apart. At last. It all makes sense. So, the bad guy takes the spellstones, your planet falls apart, and I've got to find the spellstones and bring them back to the Force Point temples. See, Mom, I told you he was good. 
Starbucks, yeah. My son will remain with you. For only a dinosaur of noble birth can breathe life into the spell stones. What? Uh, that's okay, but don't you think he's a bit young? Uh, I mean, it's gonna be very dangerous. Loads of bad guys, fighting, death. He knows the planet well, and I'm sure he's shown you his sidekick skills. Oh, yeah. I forgot about those. Come on, Fox. We'll make a great team. Okay, but if you mess up just once, I'll send you straight back to Mommy. Okay, yeah, yeah. Good. Now, our spies have indicated that Scales was last seen in Dark Ice Mines. I know the gatekeeper, Garunda Tay, a silly fellow, but he can guide you to the Spellstone. Go back to the Snowhorn Wastes and find him. Got it. And Fox, I think you'll need this. The Shark Claws dropped it when they attacked me. Maybe it'll come in use somewhere. Okay, enough already. Can I just get on with it? Alright, now that that long cutscene is over and it put us far over how long I wanted this episode to be, we got the Sharp Claw Prison Key. Remember that gate that we uh, saw a, a little while back? Yeah, this is going to help us get further there. So, in the next episode, we need to go back to Snowhorn Wastes and find the gatekeeper, Garundate. Alright, so we're saving that uh, for next time. Uh, that is all for this episode. If you like this video, go ahead and click subscribe, and give me a good thumbs up rating, and check out my other videos for more content like this. As always, thank you guys very much for watching. This has been Golden Bolt, and I will see you guys next time. Wake up, Tricky!